Hey guys, this is Look at This Lag Bro, and I'm gonna bring you something special to start this video. A quad C4. Yep, that was a quad C4. And really, my other videos, I've been ranting a lot about this game, but for once, I'm actually kind of having fun playing this game. Even though I die one off a uh, orbital VSAT or a lodestar, whatever my first kill streak may be at the uh, point that I'm playing, I still, I still manage to get like 70. 72 kills in this game and I still only get one set of streaks and I think that's pretty good I'm honestly just gonna tell you guys I'm probably I'm a, I'm bad at this game I I'm not that good at this game honestly I don't know how people get 200 plus kills in one game that's just kind of mind-boggling to me but I've been having some pretty good fun with this game because I like I play with my friends the game is it's really not the game's fault and I'm really gonna go into detail about this and what I just said it's not the game's fault the game is not that bad it's the people that play it the game doesn't control whether you camp in the back of the map with a target finder the game doesn't control whether you use ghost blind eye and cold-blooded and sit in the map back of the map and with your sniper and the game doesn't control uh, whether or not you I, I don't know what else to say. Whether or not, I'm trying to think of something here. You know, the game doesn't control every every aspect of bullshit that you would actually think it does. And one of the legendary C4, and another one of these things that I want to talk about is Vondahar patching the things that don't need to be patched. Because after after the new patch has been released, Vondahar patched SMGs again and. Why this patch SMGs again? I don't know. It's really the target finders and the shotguns that need to be patched. But instead, you punish the good players by by patching the SMGs. And that doesn't make any sense to me. The PDW is unusable now. There's so much recoil. See, this is what I'm, an example right here of a, of a player that's stupid. Fucking camping in the back of the map, just aiming down a target finder. Simple as that. But... Vondahar, the PDW is once was the best gun in the game, and now it just sucks. There is too much recoil. The bullets do no damage. It's pretty much like a nerf gun. Hip firing beats aiming down your sight, which is like this is the first game that that's happened. More bullets hit when you hip fire than when you aim down your sight. And I'm, I'm not trying to rant here again. I'm not trying to rant because I just get a legendary C4 over the wall here too, double. And the reason I just like telling you guys, I like informing the community of the facts of this game and why, why, like, Bondahar decided to patch the SMGs, I don't know, but... He, he should have patched, he should have made knifing possible, first of all, because knifing is impossible. You, I can't depend on my knife in this game. I mean, Modern Warfare 3 was a little bit ridiculous. There's another legendary C4. Modern Warfare 3 was a little bit ridiculous with the knifing, and so was Black Ops. But this game is like I've never seen anything ni like the knifing in this game. It's you can't knife. It's it's a butter knife really every time. It's a butter knife. <sighs> and going back to what I said, it's really not the game's fault most of the time sometimes that it would be the game's fault is I don't know why but I'm the only one that ever gets killed by hunter killers I'm using the TAC 45 and I mean you might think that God might give me a break when I'm going 44 and 2 with the TAC 45 but no like I'm in a window under a roof and the hunter killer decides to go for me instead of going for eight of my other teammates that are running around outside the map just has to go for me every time and that is one of the things that really does anger me in this game is that I get killed by hunter killers so many times but as you can see I picked up the load star in this game and load stars are yet to be patched I think at least swarms also got patched if you did not Swarms and dogs suck now. Swarm gets you no kills if you don't have dogs. And really, 
If you call in both dogs and swarm, you're not going to get 40 kills like you used to. You're not even going to get, like, 30. You're probably going to get 15 kills with both dogs and swarm combined. So, 200 pluses, I don't know how people keep getting them. Because the kill streaks never do anything for me in this game. I have to use, like, Lodestar, VTOL, and, like, AGR. Because those things are, are the only things in the game that haven't been patched yet. Lodestars are really good. Still not patched. Hopefully won't be patched because it takes skill to get. And apparently Vondahar does not see that punishing the good players is bad for the community. Because as you can see right there, I hit every bullet of that SMG, of that, of that uh, kill right there. And it took 18 bullets. 18 bullets from a medium, medium short range kill. 18 bullets and that's mind-boggling because in black ops we thought the guns were weak because we're used to modern warfare 2 and we thought the guns were weak in black ops and, and then you, you really said that you really uh, noticed that the guns were really balanced in black ops and then black ops 2 the guns were perfect at the beginning of the game there was no reason to patch anything Every gun was perfectly even. It was a fast-paced game, and now you need two mags. To, it takes an entire mag to kill somebody with the PDW, or really any submachine gun now. And you can't get double kills in this game unless, like you, unless they're like running in a straight line and you shoot through the first guy and the bullets like hit the second guy while you're shooting the first guy. But it's really hard to it's hard to spread doubles in this game because unless they're not looking at you, it's not it's that's it. It's not easy. <sighs> but it like it takes so many bullets to kill already when the game comes out, and now you're just making the guns take even more bullets to kill. I don't understand where you're going with this game because eventually you'll just need to go knife only because the knife will beat every gun because every gun will take 50 bullets to kill. Vector is one of the best guns in the game that I don't think it has a really high fire rate and a good damage and it's probably at this point in the game my favorite gun because of that and the range is obviously horrible because Bondahar also patched range of submachine guns they take Let's just put it this way. If there's a guy at, at the other side of the map, I actually ran into this problem the other day. There's a guy at the other side of the map on Nuketown. Say you're playing on Nuketown, and you're in one building, and there's another guy in the other building across the map. And you shoot 20 bullets. We'll say 20 bullets into him. He goes behind the wall. You He comes back out, and you shoot him with 20 more bullets, and he just kills you with a sniper. That's what happens to me. Like, too much in this game. I get killed by snipers while I'm shooting them. Which, I don't understand. Because, you're supposed to have, like, you know, the flinch when you get hit by a bullet. But, that only happens to me, I guess. So, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to get some good gameplays up here. I'm trying really hard to get 100 pluses. I'm playing with my friends. I'm not playing with my friends. I just can't seem to do it, so... Hopefully, eventually, I'll be able to do it. And until then, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to try to bring you good commentaries in the future. And please subscribe to my channel. And thank you guys so much.